The weather was really good in the UK, so I decided to venture out of London and go explore Leicester for a long weekend. My time there was split onto two days. The first day, it was mostly city exploring, and here it is. Hi everybody, welcome to Leicester. Today we are exploring the city and the historical sites um, that Leicester has to offer. There are a few buildings that are quite cool from the outside and we're gonna explore them from the inside today. But first, let's start with breakfast and then we can follow on and explore. was under a car park until they found him. They covered the rest and they saw the injuries, the battle injuries to the head. Yeah, you're more than welcome to take photos, by the way. Awesome. Um, and then they saw the scoliosis of the spine. This is where they found Richard and all the history about him and about um, the digging process on how they found him. And now let's go and see his grave in the church in front of the visiting center. Okay, let's go inside the Leicester Cathedral now and see the burial for Richard III. Today has been a little strange one. I was waking up by an Indian wedding just outside of the Airbnb that I was staying and it was the loudest thing at 9 in the morning. After the loud Indian wedding, I headed out in Leicester to go to a paint jam which is the main purpose of my visit to Leicester. The UK has a lot of legal spots for writers, um, people who do graffiti and one of them is here in Leicester. Um, in the drain storm where they have few walls that they could fill with their own creativity. I'm here in Leicester to follow the creative process and see how it's done. Okay, so the graffiti spot is right after this fence, but there is no access, so I have to climb it. And it's a bit scary for me, but you know, I'm doing this to show you the creative process, so here I go. Ow. Okay. Too bad. Let's go and see what everybody has been up to. Everybody has 
has completed their walls and it's absolutely empty now. Which is really cool. Look at some of the details in their work. And the different characters that people do, the different writing styles and backgrounds. to get some great Indian food. The spot is not halal, but it's super famous and everybody swears by their food. So I'm gonna try some of their vegetarian and seafood and let's see how good it really is. And here it is, we're here. Let's go inside and try the food. That's the end of my Leicester video. I hope you guys enjoyed the little exploration with me and it's really easy to get here and just to spend the weekend or just a day. It's, it's very quiet and there is a lot to see in a day. Like you can spread it around like I did with three days but it's really doable in shorter amount of time or longer if you just want to chill out and you know take it super easy. Um, I was very pleasantly surprised with this city um, it's more it has more to offer than I expected if you're staying longer in Leicester it might be worth checking out the little quaint towns along the river um, outside of Leicester just so you get a better idea of what's around and just chill out in the Midlands of the UK I will see you in the next video don't forget to share like and subscribe see you next time